In commemoration of the Nigerians' Democracy Day, government establishments and some private companies were under lock. About Vorami Square and Sapler Road were almost devoid of its usual also and bustle that characterized the area in the early hours of the morning. It was observed that few vehicles ply routes except for commercial bus drivers. The Edo State Secretariat complex on Sapler Road and Main Streets on Exotic Street were short just as their parking lots were empty with no workers in sight. Also, commercial institutions were under lock. Security operatives were on ground in strategic locations in the state to forestall any likely breakdown of law and order. Some respondents who spoke to the news crew were happy for the celebration of yet another Democracy Day in the country. I tend to go out much later today. No, just go out because it's the Democracy Day, so I'm celebrating it. I tend to celebrate it in my own way because at least we believe that with all this the democracy day at least we are no longer under the military government more workers are at home they are yeah because today is democracy day we are trying to see the significance of what god has done to us far back meanwhile some fun seekers besieged some recreational centers such as Bini museum ground and kada cinema and entertainment center in commemoration of democracy day some of them who expressed gladness for the day said they brought their families to unwind Today is Democracy Day, no work today. Of course, we have to make good use of the day, come out and relax with our children. Of course. As a mark to the day for the democracy, I have to bring my daughter just to come and see her safe here. We try to bring the children out because um, this is what democracy is all about. It's about the future. You know, even though we have not gotten it right now, but we, we believe that you know, there is a future for uh, the democracy of this nation. Democracy Day started in 1999 when the military government handed over power to civilians. Patience, O Saugiwa reporting.